South Korea's finance minister has been meeting with related ministers to discuss concerns about rising prices ahead of the Lunar New Year holiday, which begins in just over a week. Reflecting such concerns, the central bank says the producer price index has recorded its highest figure in more than one year. Connie Kim with the details. Finance Minister Yu Yid Ho said Thursday that Seoul will expand the supply of agricultural and fisheries products and deliver a firm response to any suppliers engaging in price fixing in response to concerns about rising prices ahead of the Lunar New Year holiday. The minister said consumer prices are in a stable 1% range, but acknowledged that people feel otherwise, in part because of price increases of eggs and some other foods due to a prolonged avian influenza outbreak and poor weather conditions. We'll do our utmost to stabilize the prices of agricultural products and processed food, along with the public utility prices, which have risen recently. We'll implement response measures for the people for the upcoming Lunar New Year holiday and manage the supply and demand and prices of agricultural products. The producer price index, which gauges price changes before products reach consumers, has hit its highest level in more than a year. The Bank of Korea said the index was at 100.8 in December, a rise of 0.8 percent from the previous month. The central bank attributed the rise to a jump in the prices of agricultural products, which rose 4.8 percent in December from the month before, and coal and petroleum products, which rose 6.8 percent on the back of high global oil prices. The producer price index, a barometer of future consumer inflation, indicates inflation could continue to be high for a while. Connie Kim, Arirang News.